Hi everybody, this is Teacher Vance in, where am I today? You're in, uh, let me look out the window, looks like Penang. Penang, Malaysia. How, how could you yeah. do that by looking out the window? Uh, because I can see Georgetown sort of from here. Ah, far away. okay. Oh, I see. Okay. And you are Bobby Bear. It just says it right on your, right over your head. Yeah, okay. I'm Bobby Bear. We have a long adventure planned today. And I'm going to close this Minecraft window and tell you about it. So, um, this is for the benefit of people who are uh, in uh, watching the video. And we are here in the middle of a desert. We're next to some tombs. Okay, I'm just trying to scroll the map around. I've got this map view and uh, it's nighttime. We're next to some temples. There's, you can see north and south on the map. It's, it's a little bit up to the upper right to the north. And um, what we're gonna do today well, it's going to be a long day. We're going to travel um, out to here, this village over here. We're going to travel to that village. And to get there, now what we're going to do overall is we're going to make a big loop. <coughs> we're going to make a big figure eight. So we're going to go up to this lava pool. There's a lava pool right there. We're going to go to the north, to the lava pool. We're going to go up onto this green area, and down to the right, we've got a um, we got a house there. But we might just go down and have a look at it. We're going to come back to it. That's part of the figure eight. Now, we're, we're going to take the path, though. We're going to take the path uh, up to this place where you can see here that someone has erected a some kind of obelisk or an antenna. I'm not really sure, and that takes us over to another area, which we're going to visit later. But for today, we're going to, that's the other part of the figure eight over there. Uh, for today, we're going to take the path along the river, and we're going to go across the river and pick up the path wherever it is. I can find it here. That's funny, I don't see the path. I can see it coming here, here it comes here, there it is right there. So we're going to cross the river there, pick up the path, which comes over here, and we're going to scamper out to this village. And it might be, by the time we get there, it might be dark. And we can sleep there in the village. Uh, so when we wake up in the morning, we're going to come back out this way, back down the path, and leave the path uh, to go to the ocean. And at the ocean, you can see that there's a, a cave here. We might pop into the cave if we feel like we have a lot of time. There's a desert village over here, which has a, a portal there. Uh, it's a, a nether portal. It, I believe it spawns in the world. It's an incompleted one. So uh, the developers have left some portals there. And from there, we can, well, it depends on how late it is. We can come up this wadi. Uh, we could come along and have a look at this pit right here. Uh, let me show you where we're going. We're going to go to this green area down here and head out back to the north where I am right now, back to the temple area. So that's going to be the left-hand part of the eight. But there are other things to do around here as well, depending on how much time we have. There's a little outpost here. The desert outpost. There's a ship, a wrecked ship there that uh, could be booby trapped. Yeah, they usually are. There they have things inside. We can go look at that. Um, we might, if we don't have time this trip around, we could do it. Oh, there's another little temple. There's a little structure right there. So there are things we can do uh, on the second day out, and that will bring us back home here. Where Bobby is. And then the next day, we can take the other part of the eight. The other part of the eight is going to take us back over to this house. And 
take us from the house. We might go to the house and well, there's another visit, a, a, a village we can visit here. And then we can go back up to the obelisk and we can go to the right and across the desert uh, through this wadi here over to this desert village and nearby <coughs> we've put a shelter here so from there we'll make a boat journey and we we'll go by boat to another island where we've set up a base it's a green island we can call it Greenland there's a base right there There's some clicking going on over there Bobby Bear okay. you hear some clicking? yeah okay it could be a monster and then we're going to go through the through the uh, terracotta here come back up this this uh, stretch of land right here and back over to our our uh, where we started our journey that is a little uh, shelter we put up here somewhere in there here it is there's the shelter Okay, so that's that's going to complete our adventures for um, for our Minecraft journey. So anyway, well, uh, it's three o'clock in the morning. So what we should do? Let me just find this. That's the plan now. It's going to be all of the tutorials I've really got planned. Let me find us on the map. Here we are. We're over here. So. Uh, we're going to get some sleep, a little rest. And Bobby, I guess you can go to sleep if you want. Sure. Okay, thanks. Good night, everybody. Good night. Okay. And I'll just make it to where we can see where we are in the map when I bring the, the map back up. Okay. So, here it is, 6 o'clock in the morning in Minecraft. And if we go out right now, we could possibly catch some mobs. I like skeletons because they uh, they have arrows and bones we can get. With bones we can plant. Uh, we Oh, look at this acacia I planted yesterday. Wow. wow. That was really, really yeah. The way it did that, I got some water and I put some water there and I got some bone meal from a from a skeleton we got. And uh, so from that, I managed to get that, um, the bone meal added to the acacia sapling. Um, gave us the big tree. Okay, I've got a couple of little steps, sand sewn steps, I suppose. This takes us over to the lava bed. And if we follow that along, we come out to the lava. Oh, there's a step right there. And when we reach the lava, we're going to head up to, it should be right here. Where's the lava? We should be right on it. Let's if not, see. Do you see the lava? Yeah. Oh. Look, follow me. Okay. Yeah, oh, yeah, there it is. Oh, my goodness. You suppose, oh yeah, okay. I didn't remember it being down there so low. So from the lava, now we're going to go to the mountain. Let's see which mountain are we going to go to. I uh, can't remember, but what I can do is I can consult the map. Let me do that. And uh, so it's a very short little hop over here. We just want to go from there over to the north. We want to go to the north and that will take us to whatever mountain is to the north. Okay, back in the game now. Press F3. I'm facing east now, so what I want to go that way. Okay, so these that's the little mountain that I'm trying to reach. Okay, press F3 again to get rid of that compass and off we go. I kind of like this part of the server because it um, it's eventful. It has desert, and you can escape the desert and get into the get into this green area here, and back in the desert if you want. It's a very nasty little crack there. 
Oh, I think Oops, I've got careful. a Don't I have a trail here? What do we got here? We got a... We did. We, start... we have something inside. Yeah, we went in there and explored one time. Okay, well, here's, here's the path. There we go. That path takes us to this path, which is the one that goes left and right. If we go down to the right, we'll go as far as where we can see our shelter, because we'll be coming back there later on. There's some steps, and that leads down to where our shelter is. You can see a compound down there. So that's where our the home is that we'll be visiting later. But for right now, for today, I want to see if I can get over to that village. And there's the obelisk, as you can see over there on the right. And we've put in all these paths. Um, makes it easier for us to find our way. And also, if something unspeakable should befall us, then we, uh, we would find our death chest. And um, hopefully that won't happen. Usually it doesn't happen in the daytime, not on this server. So here, uh, let me just let me zoom in the map just a little bit, so I can. That's a little bit too much. Okay, so there we are. So I don't want to miss this turn. So I want to go that way, not toward the obelisk. So let me put ourselves where we and, and see where the river crossing is. And there's the river crossing right there. So I'm going to put the game up. It will cover us, and then, but it will help us to find the river crossing quite easily. So, okay. So um, we need a path that goes off to the to the right. Is that it? That's it. To the left. Sorry, to the left. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So here we are going to the left now. And we, there's the river. Okay, so we're going to follow that way. And it looks like we're, you know, something? We're, we, we're back in the old service pack. Yeah, there's no more winter. Yeah, the blizzard has passed. It's not Christmas anymore. Which do you prefer? Do you like winter or this standard view? Um, winter was nice for a little while, but basically I like this one. I think better, I like this I one. It's, it's easier to follow uh, because yeah. it, it's familiar. We've been this way so many times and we have familiar paths here. Okay, so yeah. across the river. Yeah, okay, go ahead. I'm going to just shift the map a little bit. Yeah, but with the service packs, it's always fun when you log in and there's a little surprise. But mm -hmm. um, I enjoy this one the best, though. Yeah, it's standard, the familiar. Yeah. Okay, well, we should. I've moved the game over our map, but we should come out. Uh, we should emerge on our map shortly. We meander a little bit, don't we? We do. <laughs> there mm -hmm. we come. Okay, we've emerged. We're heading now more or less to the west. If the sun gets down, we'll be able to see that. We've put a lot of torches here on the path. Sometimes we get caught out at night. And uh, then we're... It's a lot safer if you have some torches. And sometimes we just use torches to help us to find our way. <clears throat> okay, so we're going to go up a little bit to the northwest here. Ducks. And coming out on the, the green part, which we can just barely see on the map. Okay, so the village is down here somewhere. Almost there. There it is. I think I see it over in the distance here. But since I can see it, I don't really need to scroll the map over. We'll just head for the village. You remember this village, Bobby? I do. It's interesting. Mm -hmm. What's interesting about it? 
Oh, just uh, running into the villagers and exploring the little houses. It doesn't have a fence around it, so I don't know if anybody is... Oh, oh, oh fell down into the... Oh, oh. <laughs> are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. And there, there's oh, a... Oh, there's a skeleton the, there. Careful. The yak, the yak guy is here. It's not a skeleton. Oh, it's, it's a yak. Yaks. And okay. a cow. Yeah. Okay. Oh, no. Big... Are they stuck down there? <laughs> they might be, but I'll tell you what, they won't be stuck because I'm going to dig my way out. So it's okay. shoveling. And dig way out here okay. and you can also tp to me if that's faster i could well it's faster but this is more fun okay so this is the way we normally do it there are, those things could come out of there and if we want to get down there later we can do that okay so here we are it's the villagers place let's go look around Going for villagers for yeah it's 1600 so probably we'll need to uh I'm not sure. This is a map. A cartographer lives here. So if you need a map, you can... I'm not sure how to use the cartography table. But I suppose if you know how to use it, you can. Oh, and there's a chest here. What's inside the chest? Bread! Okay. If you're hungry, you can find some bread. I wonder what kind of farms they have here. I don't think we've... I think we've been in that one. Um, let's go to the other side of the village. It's very quiet here today. Yeah. There's another one of these tall structures over here. Let me get, oh, there's a, there's a villager. Shall we talk to him? We to should. Say. He says, if I have 32 rotten fleshes, he'll give me an emerald. And if I have an emerald, he'll give me two redstone dusts. So now I don't have either of those on me, but we could always come back here and bring these things. Uh, I had emeralds, but I've stashed them somewhere. Okay, well, villagers are going into their homes now, so I guess maybe we should go and find one to crash. And I learned from sad experience that the best thing to do is just kick them out of their beds. Oh, well, of course, we, we've got beds, but no, we're going to need to take our beds. So the best thing to do is uh, remove a villager. So let's just go in and see what we can find. Just find a bed. There's a bed there. I think I'll take this one. I'll displace this villager. Okay. Or do you want to come in here? I can find oh. another one. Okay. If you find another one, then uh, it's probably not quite night yet, but uh, it's almost 1900 now, so say in about 1930, it should be... Uh, time to go to bed. So the best thing to do as we found out is to displace the villager because then you have a bed spawn. Whereas if you lay your own bed there and then you take it with you, unless you're planning to leave it, then you have no bed spawn. And that could be tragic. So uh, words to the wise. Okay, well uh, we're about done here. This is uh, let me just show you where we are on the map. So you'll, you'll know here we are. Bobby has found a little place over there, so I'll see her. Are you asleep now, Bobby? Did you find a bed? I found a bed now. Should I go to sleep? Okay. Yeah, yeah, you can go to sleep. No. Yep. Yeah, and okay. there's no villager, so it's an empty bed. Oh, okay, okay. Well, I'll tell you what, then uh, you can just sleep there, and when it gets light, I'll come to you. Okay. Good night, everybody. Okay. Good night, and meanwhile, back in the game. This is Teacher Vance. I don't have to disturb this villager. And now it's light. The villager is up. I'm wondering what the heck I'm doing here. Let's see what he's got to offer. Oh, he, he, he was the same one who had the rotten flesh. Okay. Well, um, we're not going to do anything. I like to keep these down to about 20 minutes. And uh, I think Bobby and I are probably just going to park ourselves somewhere here. And in the, the next time we do this, we're going to go uh, down into the desert, to the other de the desert village there. So shall we just maybe just come in here to the cartographer's place and just close the door? And then we'll be safe. When we uh, come back later, we'll, we'll be here. So this is uh, Bobby Bear. And let me look out the window. She's in 
Penang, Malaysia, it looks like to me. And Teacher Vance. And I want to say good night. See you later. Good night. Bye, everyone.